What's up, people? This is your boy Ari Chatted over here. So, this video is basically about parents who tell their children good things, but children don't obey their parents and think that it, it's kind of like a joke. First point parents who say that you're making your own future. Your future depends on your own hands. If you make if you make your future good, that's a good thing. If you make your future bad, um, I wouldn't comment on that. So a lot of kids just think that as a joke. They say that, aha, whatever, and they just move on with life. But in the future, they actually realize what their parents told them to do in the first place. Then, then they realize that, oh, should have done that when my parents told me to. Second point. When parents tell you to do your dishes, that is not just doing for the sake of doing. It, it go, grows in your habit. So later in life, when you're like alone, you know, you're like alone, just living alone and doing everything in your own. If you don't have the habit of washing the dishes, it can be a very big mess. The dishes can just pile up on the sink. You haven't washed, them di washed the dishes since two or three days or even a week. And that's a, that's a very bad thing. Then you will realize in the future that I, if I would have obeyed my parents and do, did the dishes once in every two days, that would be very good for me. Sec third thing. That was second thing. Third example. If your parents, it's another life lesson, you know, that your parents tell you. So if your parent, parent tells you to, you know, clean your room, um, as usual, it's not like you're not doing for the sake of doing it make you, it's like building up a habit a habit it, it's building up a habit it's a good habit it's not like a bad habit because clean up clean, cleaning your room is a very good habit it's like your room is like clean and tidy you will just have a peaceful mind because I've learned in a very in a very in very hard times that if you have a messy room your mind gets distracted a lot but if you have like a clean clean and tidy room your mind just doesn't get distracted that much let me tell you my room is not that clean honestly I will I will I wouldn't lie but the thing that I've learned that if you have a messy room you have a you you will have a messy mind I'm not just I'm not just um telling this for the sake of telling. I have I have at these things that I'm telling has actually been to my experience in my whole life. Full thirteen years in my life. I'm thirteen. And yeah, these are all the experience that I went went through. Now another thing. If your parents parents tell you to do your work in a very you know cleanly way and a very and if you complete your work, your parents are not just telling you to you know just just do it just do it whatever you want to do. Your parents are actually guiding you. It'll be a habit, you know. So if if you are doing an incomplete work, that is not good. That is actually very bad, and I've, I've I did this in the past before, and my parents were not that happy at all. They were pretty angry. So you better not do something. Better do something. Um. Just better just do something neat than not doing it at all. So if you like, if you, I, I think you will not get me what I'm saying, 
But I'm trying to say that it's better than not doing anything than doing something incomplete. That what I meant to say. So it's better than not doing anything than just doing it, but not doing it that perfectly. Because if your parents tell you to clean clean your bed, you just clean it, you know, just clean, 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 and you're done. There's no value to it. You have to put your heart into it, put your soul into it, not soul into it, but like, you know, put your everything into it. And you're like, you'll be like pretty relaxed when you're done with the work. There'll be no um, delays that, oh, you didn't um, do the thing properly. Make sure you do the thing properly. And you'll be like, oh my god. You'll be like so frustrated if your parents tell you that you have to do that properly. I haven't seen you doing it properly. Do it properly. If you do it properly in the first place, I you I bet you you'll be very you'll be much better off. So this was my um I think my four points, yeah, four to five points that I had to say. So what your, the lesson is that if your parents, parents are telling you to do something, just do it, man. Don't be such a weenie that, oh, I don't want to do it. No, I don't like to do it. Don't do that. If, you do, if, if your parents are telling you to do something, like wash the dishes, clean your, clean, Cleaning up your room or doing the vacuum. Don't just do it for the sake of doing. Because that is like, you know, your stepping stone of your life. And not education wise, but it's like your life. Because education doesn't matter in this thing. But it's kind of like a life lesson for you. Life education. What I say in quote unquote. Life education for you. So, if you learn anything in this video, just hit a like, subscribe to my channel, share this video to many friends, family you have, and just peace out.